Hello, my beautiful fire signs. Welcome to Real Up Tarot with Renee. Thank you guys for all your likes, your shares, your subscribes. I truly appreciate you guys. All your support, your love. Auntie Renee, love you. Miss you guys so much. Let's get into it, fire signs. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. What's good? Okay, it's been good. This will be your end of April reading going into your May 2023. We are headed in straight into Taurus season. Happy birthday, Tauruses, right? This is for my fire signs. Someone rising Venus moon node. Let's get into it. You guys, make sure to hit the like, share, subscribe button as you guys come in to watch this video. So I can get out to other Aries, Leos, and Sagittarius who need to receive this message. Fire signs. What's the messages from the divine for Fire signs, highest good. Ooh, new moon in Capricorn, step up and lead. Okay. We also have last quarter moon in Capricorn, leave the past behind. So if you guys have been, oh, I just got this for um water sign or earth sign. Which one? One of the two. Yeah, leave the past behind. It's time to move forward. Yeah, it was, it was water. Leave the past behind. It's time for you to step up and leave. Okay, new moon in Sagittarius. Look at y'all showing up. Focus on the positive. You cannot change the past, that's for sure. And first quarter moon in Cancer. Push through any insecurities, right? Right, fires. Fire signs. Let's get into it, okay? Some of you guys could um, be questioning yourself, self-doubting. Okay, and that's going to keep you in stagnant energy. You guys have to find that balance within yourself, okay, to um, have faith in, in, and know that you can um, have anything that you want, okay? But something that happened in your past is keep keeping you in uh, a, a negative uh, state of mind, which is why Spirit is asking you at this time to focus on the positivity in a situation. And if you want something, you need to step up and lead, you know, especially when it comes to Empress. I just saw the Empress here, um, Libra energy, Taurus energy. You guys could be done with one of those energies, okay? I just saw it. Yes, the Hermit Virgo energy. You guys have been doing some deep soul searching when it comes to the connection or just your overall um, abundance um, with, with regards to your career, um, what you're passionate about, okay? Your wish fulfillments, okay? Oh, that is bright. So, sorry about the, the brightness in the room. I do have a, it's, it's, it's kind of bright and pretty out, so I want to have a, the shades open. Yeah, seven of cups I see here, two of wands for a movement, okay? We have options, right? Five of cups, seven of cups. We have options. Something you could have found out, you could have found out about some illusions, night is always energy, now you want to take some swift action let's leave past the leave the past behind spirit for my fire signs what is it yeah high priestess yeah you know you know what's good for you what's not good for you right you're making a decisive decision to leave the past behind and you're it's some fast communication is about to come in yeah you could be giving somebody some fast communication eight of wands energy sagittarian energy here on the board strong are you about to get some quick news um Fire signs, um, yeah, four of pentacles, yeah, that you're holding on to a situation or someone's holding on tight when it comes to an ace of cups energy, yeah. So there is definitely some type of emotional readiness when it comes um, to a connection that you guys are uh, wanting to be in. High Priestess is your third eye talking to you guys, okay? There it is, third eye right there in the middle. You guys have some inner knowing and you're making a decisive decision right to move leave the past behind and move forward right you're gonna communicate something very fast or swiftly you guys to someone about a uh, wanting stability um in the situation or someone could be communicating this to you when it comes to an ace of cups um connection this is someone you guys could be headed towards marriage or looking to have a long-term commitment or marriage with someone but some of you guys um this could involve a family situation but whatever the case is the sun is here leo energy look at y'all showing up fire signs in your reading someone makes you very happy wow 
and um, with the Page of Cups here. And there's like going to be some new excitement and love or some of you guys are going into a new love connection. Yes. Six of Wands to the Tower. So some changes are going to happen. You're going to have a very, you're going to be, you're going to be successful of whatever it is that you want. Whatever this stability is, it's going to be successful, but it is going to uh, bring upon a lot of changes with the Tower card being here. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Very much so, right? Or this could be a tower for someone in your energy. Why is this here for the fire signs? Yeah, you guys could have been enlightened about something or someone. Temperance angel, yeah. Yeah, okay, that peace and harmony is coming in. Sagittarian energy, very strong. Look at y'all fire signs. I know that's right. Yes, Archangel Michael in the building. Yeah, bringing in this peace and balance harmony okay you guys were very patient um i feel you know to come in to balance into union with someone for some of you guys or to come into determination that you want to be oh come on with the lovers here and shake a spirit love oh yeah sh come on shake a spirit love shake a spirit love let me put it on here it's actually like this yeah, to come in and, and bring in some love situation. Gemini energy here, very strong. Okay, there's about to be a new love connection in your life, fire signs. Come on, Emperor. Look at you. Yeah, Aries energy. Yes, you're going to be very successful, very strong. Yes, yeah, somebody's coming in. Five of Swords, Tower. So you guys could... You guys could either, I feel like you guys are fighting for this, but there's someone in your energy um, who's upset and they want to fight about it. It's causing a, a very painful ending for someone else. Tower card is here. Yep. Yep. Seven of Pentacles. Somebody who tries to cause delays to this connection, which it, um, when it came to your wish fulfillment and you're getting your wishes fulfilled. Yeah. Somebody really tries to cause, cause delays. Yeah. And now someone's in deep anguish that, you guys are getting your wishes fulfilled. They could want to cause some drama and strife to this connection, but you guys are fighting for what it is that you want. You're in your emperor energy. I know that's the fuck right. Come on, fire signs. Let's get it. Karmic justice. Yeah. With the uh, justice card here, could be dealing with the Libra. Don't have to be. Yeah. Four of pentacles. Five of pentacles is here on the split when it, when it comes to queen of cups. You guys are leaving the queen of cups out in the cold. Justice is being served. You're getting your nine of cups. For some of you guys, it's fair judgment. Everybody, I mean, it's fair judgment is being called here. Could be dealing with the Libra. Don't have to be. But it is definitely karmic justice being served. Somebody's definitely being uh, left out in the cold. The devil. Woo. Yep. There it is. Devil to the five of pentacles. Third party. Three. Yep. Three of cups. I can't make it up. Yep. Somebody gave us giving a false offer, a fake offer. You don't want it. You don't want it. Devil energy, five of pentacles, three of cups. Yeah, this third party energy. Very karmic energy here. Yep, three of swords. You leave them out. They're about to be pissed, heartbroken, or whatever. Definitely laying something to rest with this energy, and you're moving towards your love. Yeah. You guys are moving towards love, and this is mutual love. At that. Damn. I know that's right, fire signs. You better get it. You better get it. You better get it. I know. Right, yeah, and somebody is pissed off, stressed, yes, wanting, yeah, because they see you b defending what it is that you want, you're determined to get what it, it is that you want, and somebody's in mental anguish be about behind this. Nine of Swords energy here, Queen of Pentacles, yeah, so you guys are going towards your a peaceful abundance, but it also could be a mother figure that's in this energy that you're moving forward, stressed out. There you are. King of Wands, Leo Aries Sag. Yeah, you're ending old cycles and you're starting something all the way new. Yeah, you had enough. You had, there's the Seven of Cups. I saw it. You're tired of the illusions or whatever and you're making a decision. Yeah, to build a foundation. Three of Pentacles. Yeah, come in with this flowing attraction. Knight of Cups and have this equal give and take. Six of Pentacles. All right, I can't make it up. Listen, and y'all know, I to be shuffling, shuffling. <laughs> 
somebody's not going to be happy that you guys are going towards your happiness with the sun card here. Something has definitely been illuminated. And whatever's been illuminated, um, the information that you found out is helping you come into peace and balance when it comes to this love connection. It's like some additional information that you guys were seeking is um, you could have found out. I don't need the Page of Swords to be here. Uh, to know that, uh, that that's the energy. Because it's definitely the energy. Oof. Somebody's mad. What's going on for my fire signs? Yeah, Aries Sagittarius. Yeah, Ten of Cups, Two of Swords. Yeah, you guys are making a decision or needing to make a decision when it comes to Queen of Pentacles. Yeah, Judgment. Yeah, Knight of Cups again. Too many illusions. What's causing? It's a heavy burden. So there's the Queen of Pentacles in your energy who's been trying to cause some type of delays or something like that. That's the truth. Yeah, and, and for your forward movement, but there will be Cancerian energy is here. You guys are persevering over all the bullshit. Yeah, you're setting your priorities with the Two of Pentacles, Seven of Wands. Will of Fortune is in your favor. Yeah, Knight of Cups here. There's your twin flame, Four of Wands. Family dynamic. Yep. Mm -hmm. Yep. And the world card again. Damn. All right. So let me just pull these up and I'm going to pull some backstory here. Yeah. A lot of truths are being revealed. Clarity, truth and clarity. When it comes to the Ten of Cups that you guys desperately want, you guys are looking for happiness, not, you know, nothing less. You're not looking for anything less. If it ain't, if it ain't got a happy ending to it, you don't want it. Yep. Third party energy is in despair. Yeah, we got the devil here, Capricorn energy, very much strong, um, is being left out in the cold, whoever these negative Bettys is, third-party energies, who's been trying to cause delays, yeah, who's been giving you false offers, keeping you in the three of energy, you're, o you're over it. I know that's right, fire signs. It's like, you know what, enough of the bullshit. I want, I'm moving towards my happiness. All you guys is a bunch of goofies, you know. And this could be karmic family, friends, love, or past lovers, um, you know, situationships, you name it. All right, so I'm gonna shuffle these back in. You know, the fool, there. Yeah, fool, you're taking the leap of faith and you're manifesting what it is, what you want to come in. I know that's right. Listen, listen, how do you know? Yeah, it's okay. It's, you know, it's necessary. These changes, Tower Energy, very much necessary in order for you guys to move into what it is that you want for your life. Yeah, you're definitely manifesting very strong. I'm shuffling and manifestation is still here. Who missing your energy fire signs? Yeah, somebody was false as fuck. Yep, you can't even relate to them. Thank you, spirit. Oh, that's too many. Yeah, optimistic. Yeah. Somebody was very unrelatable. Yeah, wanted you stuck and stagnant. Yeah, and now they're in heavy despair. Don't play. Yeah, very much counterfeit. Damn, this came out in the other reading. Yeah, and now they're burdened and stressed that you're moving forward. With Yeah, because you, you remain op optimistic, but your optimism left someone else heartbroken. Okay, fire signs? Yeah, love always wins. When it's all said and done, you guys are just going towards love. You're going towards love. You're going towards happiness. You're going towards who needs your energy, who's there for you. You know what I'm saying? You guys uh, could be dealing with a cancer. Don't have to be or have cancer in your chart. Long life plan, lifelong plans. Yeah, you're blocking energy from this cancer, whoever you're dealing with, who's a con artist. They didn't, never served you no good fire signs. But this was faded. Okay, thank you, spirit. Love versus war. Somebody definitely tried to have you in a spiritual warfare. Yeah, you're an anointed being, and this is definitely passed down karma. Damn, this came out in the other one. Unstoppable forces here. Absolutely. Absolutely. What else? This is a thick deck, y'all. Anything to pop out. Fire signs, they're mad. I shuffle. Listen, they mad. Pay attention to the red flags. Yep. Yeah, they're mad and they want to reach out to you soon. This Aquarius, because they got something to say or whatever. But this Aquarius is what started all the drama in your life um, in the first place, right? Listening to the wrong energies, listening to the wrong advice, listening to people who wanted to see you not have all your true love and abundance or whatever for their own selfish reasons. Yeah, they played themselves though. Yeah. Mm. 
for some of you guys, the police and vet and, and feds could be involved in the situation. Take out resonates by your signs. Yeah, oh my god. Fake offer. Yeah, I told y'all. Somebody was offering you a fake offer. There was counterfeit as fuck. It came out. Yeah. Fake asses. Yeah, counterfeit. Don't play with me. Counterfeit. Fake offer. Listen, somebody was fake as fuck. They lied. Yeah, uh, uh, now you now they see you on a quest for self knowledge and improvement. Yeah, oh, sorry, this is the cars flying everywhere. They mad, mad though. Yeah, devil energy came out. Rewind the video, fire signs came, make it up. It's in the tarot. These are the intuitive things for your highest good. Give me more information behind the scenes dealing with my fire signs. Leo, Aries, Sagittarius, someone rising Venus, North Node. Thank you guys for tuning in. Yeah, for your quick energy read. What's going on, fire signs? What else do you need to know for your highest good? Mm -hmm. Fighting and conflicts. That's all you've been dealing with, right? So whoever this is, whether you're in spiritual warfare, right? Drama, chaos, and mayhem. Yeah, oof. Yeah. It was a major loss. Yeah, it was a major loss for them. Yeah, but you got a love offer coming in. I know that's the fuck right. Period. And it's already, it already came out of Terry. It's always something with this person. It's always something. It's always some type of drama. Always caught up in some type of BS. You're over it. You're letting them go. Yeah, you're going towards this love offer that's coming in. It's coming. Yep. Somebody who's a healing energy, who's going to love you immensely. Oh, that's beautiful. A Libra. I can't make it up. Who has very good intentions towards you? Fire signs. Mm -hmm. Views. Yeah, you guys. Yeah, you guys. Mm, they could be a beautiful view. You and them. They could be watching you. You watching them. I know that's right. Yeah, you know, I tell you, it's a Libra, so I resonate. <laughs> yes, yeah, somebody got Capricorn in their energy. Strong. Mm-hmm. Capricorn could be watching y'all too. What is the spirit for the fire signs? Somebody, yeah, somebody who has secret animosity towards you. And the devil card came out. That's Capricorn energy. Sorry, babies. Sorry, Cappies. I don't mean that in a negative way, but this is for the fire signs. Yeah. Somebody's telling, yeah, they want you to abort the mission. Yeah. And praying for your sweet, loving energy. Yeah. Or you could have aborted a mission in the past. Yeah. Hoping you fail, sending you negative attacks. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's why you aborted the mission with this person. Thank you, spirit. And made a deal, made a badass deal with the devil. And the devil card came out in the tarot. Rewind the video. Rewind the video. Can't make it up. What is this? Yeah, you're highly favored by the divine masters when it comes to this love situation that's coming in for you, period. You're going to get all your voices fulfilled. And whoever did this to you is regarding their actions. Yep, reversed energy. Come on. So you guys transmuted that energy right on back to the ass. Thank you, spirit. Trying to take you down. Yep, big tears crying over you, boo. I know that's right because you're going towards this Libra energy possibly. Or whoever this is, but somebody is in, yeah, karmic energy is in your energy strong, right? Fire signs. Mm. If this is resonating with you guys, sound out up in the comment field. Okay, I'm gonna get the potential outcome for you guys. Just a second. Put these back. I just can't make it up. That's why I like shuffle in front of y'all. Because, baby, one thing energy don't do is lie. Okay? It don't. It don't lie. Oof. Always trust your intuition. Somebody hates that you do. Somebody hates that you do, and that's why they're in big tears. Okay, fire signs. Yeah. Mm hmm. Some of you guys are a fire sign dealing with another fire sign who's sending you negative energy. Believe it. Yeah. Yeah. It happens. It happens in every sign. Doesn't matter. And every element doesn't matter. Yeah. Sometimes, you know, you'll be in your, your higher energy. And someone else, yeah, you're manifesting wish fulfillment. Come on. Thank you, spirit. Yeah. Yeah, eight of wands energy. I'm pulling it because that's the energy I feel. You guys, whatever it is that you guys are manifesting, you guys, your wishes are coming true with the star energy here. Aquarian energy, either you or your person. They have Aquarius in your um, chart. Gemini energy with the, uh, with the magician here. 
Mm-hmm. Somebody's watching you, Page of Swords, Knight of Pentacles. Watching you heavy, you know. Or you could be watching them heavily. Take it how it resonates. Fire signs. Somebody is watching you heavy, you and your person. Somebody's watching you get everything you manifested. I'm telling you. Night of Pentacles, something is slow to come, but it's coming. Mm -hmm. Seven of Wands. Yeah. Somebody is very defensive or, you know, wanting to fight off competition when it comes to a connection. Ooh, somebody in the past, I, I feel genuinely that wants to come and fight for you, but they're not coming with the right intentions. Someone from your your dark past is what I energetically feel. I feel like you guys know this and you were bored with the offer. They could have offered you something, but you, you energetically you felt they weren't sincere. Yeah, Emperor Energy. Because you're in your Emperor Energy. Yeah, you ended it. Yep, yeah, you ended it. Give me more. Judgment. Yeah, you ended it. You made a judgment call. Karmic justice is being served. Yeah, you're manifesting your wishes, right? And judgment has already been called and placed on this connection. Yeah, it's in the upright. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you could have learned some truth. High priestess energy. Yep. Yeah, you listen to your you listen to your intuition about a decision, and now you're about to get what it is that you manifested. Yeah. Mm hmm. And yeah, and balance is being restored. Yeah, when it comes to your wishes being fulfilled, star energy. So uh, there's a bright opportunity coming your way. Yeah, what else, spirit? What else for my fire signs? The very Sag, Will of Fortune. Look at that. In the upright, faded. Yeah. So some of you guys are about to, everything that's happening is about to be faded. You trust your intuition. You made a decisive decision as well to go towards your wish fulfillment, bring some equal balance um, and give and take to a situation. Yeah. Nine of Wands. Yeah. Someone, who, you know, you're coming in as the wounded warrior. That's okay. You could have blocked energy or whatever. Whatever you did, whatever was necessary, fire signs in order to have this forward movement to have equal give and take. Yep, and stability. Knight of Swords, look at it, it's coming in fast. Yep, you was holding on tight to whatever it is that you wanted. Yeah, and now there's that lucky twist of fate. It's like you never gave up on what it is that you wanted. It's just like you see whoever this person is in your energy that you're thinking about, you see them as long term stability. Mm hmm. I feel like you never let them go. They never let you go. It's manifesting in. And you, it's like you overcame any adversities, challenges, obstacles. Yep. Nine of Swords. Somebody's stressed. You're full of anxiety due to this. They can't block your energy anymore. Yeah. A Queen of Cups. They're in the Ten of Swords. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Ooh, nine of, yeah, nine of swords to the queen of cups to the ten of swords. Yeah, they stressed over you, fire signs. Yeah, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. They in, ooh, they in heavy, heavy, heavy despair. Mm. Somebody played, somebody played the game wrong. Yep. Eight of wands and they're getting this communication swiftly that you are moving on. Ciao. Yep, you moving on. Six of swords. Don't play with me. Yeah. <laughs> Need a change. Yeah, you this is, you know. You're you know, you're um you're 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 just, you know, moving to calmer waters with the six of swords. Yeah, you are. It's a needed change, you know. It's just like, yeah, you're tired of the fighting, the arguing, the the conflicts, you know what I'm saying? You know, thank you. Yep, and you and you're going to address. Yeah, it's a ten of wands, heavy. Yeah, ace of pentacles. Whatever it is, you, it's about to come in. It's about to come in. It's, it's you've been carrying such a heavy burden. Yep, to get to this ace of pentacles, and it took so much courage and strength, Leo energy here. It's just like, and it took a lot of confidence to forge ahead. This has been a, such a heavy burden to have this forward movement. Yeah, page of wands. Yep. Now, look, you got to, about to get this news by tomorrow. Yep. What is it for my fire signs? Okay, both of them. Yeah. Look at y'all. You're traveling towards your love. 
four of wands. Yeah, for some of you guys, this could be grateful togetherness. Listen, you guys are definitely growing and moving forward. You're traveling towards your, for some of you guys, it's your twin flame soul connection to be together with your person. What is it? Page of Pentacles. You're about to make an offer or, or this is an opportunity. Something is coming in. The devil is here. Why? Five of Pentacles. Yeah, because you believe in the mountain of cold. Yep. Ooh. So you're taking an opportunity to 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 have this forward movement. Somebody's be going to be given an offer, but there's devil energy here that is pissed off and is trying to cause some type of strife with the Five of Pentacles. Yeah, they they want to delay it. Seven of Pentacles. Yeah, keep somebody who was keeping illusions. They're pissed off that you're yeah you're laying something to rest. Lots of secrets, shadows, illusions around this person. King of Cups. Eight of Swords. Somebody wanted you to ha have self-doubt about having forward movement to go towards your wish fulfillment. The star card energy here. And you guys are like, you know what? I feel like you guys are moving in silence too. You're very emotional. And so for some of you guys, it's just, yeah, third party here. They wanted to keep you, they wanted to keep you in mental distress and cause delays towards your happiness. Yep, they're regretting it now, Five of Cups. Yeah, because you're having victory success regardless. All right, Fire Signs. So this is what I have for you. I hope it resonates with you, okay? But yeah, someone really wanted to keep you on a whole bunch of illusions and you know, chaos, strife, and mayhem when it comes to um, your wish fulfillment or whatever, but you're headed towards the Ace of Pentacles, right? And it was very difficult for you guys. We had to cut ties with individuals, with people, you know, in order to have, you know, what it is that you wanted, Knight of Swords, okay? This is, this is an unstoppable force. It's like nothing can stop you guys having your wish fulfillment, and that's just that on that. Well, the fortune is definitely in the upright and things are definitely balancing out for you guys with the Six of Pentacles. That's just period, right? All, all the seeds that you have um, planted are growing and you're about to get all of the fruits of your labor, which is why you are uh, got the Wheel of Fortune, the Six of Pentacles, and the Eight of Pentacles. You guys have to be very, very strong and uh, fight off a lot of devil energy, a lot of third party energy, a lot of negative a lot of negative Bettys in your energy, period, okay? So, this is what I have for you guys, Fire Signs. If it resonates, sound up in the comment field below. Make sure to hit the like, share, subscribe button as you guys watch this video so it can get out to other Fire Signs um, that may need to get this message. If you'd like to donate to the channel, guys, if you'd like to book um, a personal reading or sign up for the next um, class on how to read tarot or the class for May 7th, um, that the, the how to read tarot in the upright and in the reverse is May 20th and 21st is a two day zoom class. Um, and, um, this four hours each day, I teach you how to read in the upright and in the reverse, upright the first day, reverse in the second day. That's May 20th and 21st. Um, and if you want to learn how to uh, read tarot with your intuition, so for those of you who already know how to read tarot, but you know how to um, learn how to apply your intuition to it. Um, that class is May 7th on Sunday. It's also a Zoom class. It's for four hours. All right. All of that information is in the description box below. And um, the link to sign up as well. Um, if you have any questions or if you need to be put on a payment plan. Well, I'm not doing the payment plan anymore, guys, because the um, the cutoff date for this class is on the 30th. So it's just a few days away. So, you know, hit me up. Um, but all how to pay... All the links and everything is in the description box, okay? I love you guys so much. I'll see you on the next one, Fire Signs. Bye.